Well, if you look up, way up, you might see it, a white dome atop Little Sandwich Mountain. Since 1918, it's been a landmark and the place where some of the country's best star watchers have learned about and observed the night sky. That dedication has paid off in some impressive discoveries. And now it's earned the Dominion Astrophysical Observatory status as a national heritage site. A News reporter Shachi Curl has a story. The Dominion Astrophysical Observatory. It may look like a humble little dome. It certainly came from humble beginnings. But more than 90 years after astronomers first began watching the skies here, the facility is finally getting the kind of recognition it deserves. We, we were very delighted at, at this honor. The DAO is now a national historic site, having spent the better part of a century observing the night sky and learning learning about the solar system and space. The place was first opened and run by astronomer John Plaskett. The first mirror for his giant telescope was built in 1912. It's basically melted wine bottles. The, the blank uh, was got on the last ship leaving Europe before the outbreak of World War I. And when it arrived at the observatory to go into the Plaskett dome, they actually rolled it into the dome on its edge. Much of the equipment had to be hauled up Little Saanich Mountain on horseback. But that turn of the century engineering ended up being responsible for a lot of out of this world breakthroughs. They were able to calculate <coughs> the mass, the, the weight if you will, and, and the basic dimensions, the size of our Milky Way galaxy. The floor tile says 1916, and yes, this is a national historic site now, but the work being done here with that old telescope still has modern day applications. Technologies changed, but some of the country's smartest scientists still run up these stairs to stare at the sky through this giant telescope. And then there's the stuff straight out of Hollywood. The little blue box down here is an asteroid that's about the size of a Volkswagen bus. Which brings us to the next hundred years. Space is cool, but kids have a lot of other things to interest them these days. Are they still as interested in the night sky and the great beyond? The natural curiosity of children attracts nearly all of them at some stage to questions about astronomy. You know, how big is the sun, how far away is the sun or the moon. And it's the infinity of space that will keep people peering from this little dome for decades to come. In Saanich, Shachi Curl, A News.